hybridized program was uh, being explored at the exploratory stage between 1980 to 82. It was, uh, I vividly recall the experience that uh, during the board of trustees meeting, the chairman of the board would come normally about uh, a couple of days before, like on Friday and spend the weekend here when the board meeting starts on Monday. And I remember Dr. Clarence Gray was the chairman in 1981. And on Saturday morning, he had this uh, routine of taking a ride at Erie Farm, looking at what is going on. And there were many scientists used to work even on Saturdays in the field. And that was the season in April 1981, I think that was the time that I was trying to convince myself and also present the experimental evidence whether hybrid rice would be a practical option for the tropical rice farmers. And I was looking at my trial and about maybe around 11 o'clock in the morning and he passed by and he stopped. I saw me in the field and he did know at the time Dr. Nile Brady was the, uh, the, the director and he did know that Erie was trying to explore about hybrid rice and everybody was asking Erie about hybrid rice. So he stopped and I showed him the, the trial and showed him certain hybrids that were just experimental hybrids and uh, compared to the high yielding varieties like IR36, IR42 and so on. And when he saw it that uh, time when he was really convinced that yes, there is something to it and then he had a lunch with Nile Brady uh, after that visit and during that he mentioned that I saw this hybrid program in Erie and it looks like there is some promise and then the following week after the board meeting was over then Nile uh, kind of organized a GU scientist uh, meeting and visit to that experimental plot. And I think that was a kind of turning point when the management as well as the board of trustees got convinced that yes, this is something serious that we should make a commitment. And that's one example of how how things uh, were kind of came into being and then brought the 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 commitment to hybridized work at Erie.